Robin is starting this out with the biggest get of all. Ellen DeGeneres set to host for the second time. Robin sat down with her last night to talk about everything going on in her life and what it means to host Hollywood's premiere night. You're a little busy right now. You're busy. You, oh. I can't believe you just flew in and we're talking. This is great. I've known you for many years. I've seen you in different places. You look great. You Thanks. just feel at peace uh, where you are with Portia and yeah. the house and just everything that's going on in your life. I'm really happy and I'm really grateful. I have, I have, I have accomplished more than I could have, I could have ever dreamt, you know, to accomplish in my life. I think there's something to be said, you know, as you get older, you get comfortable in your skin. And not to say that I don't have days where I'm not comfortable in my skin and days that I, I feel, you know, down or whatever. Well, people have been cheering for you. I mean, it's, it's, you went through professionally a little rough patch mm -hmm. um, some time ago, and it's almost like it's in the rearview mirror. Yeah. It's got to be gratifying to know um, that people get you. Yeah. They get you now. Portia said when we, uh, when we got married, one of the things she said to me in, in her vows was, you know, it's, uh, it's one thing to be loved, but it's profound to be understood. Mm. And and that's what you, you that's all you want from people. You know, I can't expect everybody to, to you know, love me and, and like everything I do and but I just want people to to understand me and to get me and know what my intentions are. And my intentions are to make people happy and my intentions are to never hurt anybody and my intentions are to have compassion um, and to hope I can spread that a little bit every single day. Anytime you go to a chiropractor, they make you feel so bad about yourself. And, and uh, last year, I, I think I talked about this, he told me I was sitting wrong. Now I'm standing wrong. If I want someone to point out my flaws, I'm gonna go to family dinners. I don't need him. <laughs> You're in front of an audience all the time. This is a big deal. It's the Oscars. What's the difference? Oh, there's a big difference. That, that audience comes to see me and they travel from, and God bless them, they travel from all over the world to come to a taping and they wait for a year for tickets they're my core group of people that get me know me um and and love me and and i feel that and i you know that's that room is like church i mean that really mm -hmm. every single day that i do my show it is an energy that is like no other energy the way you are with your audience is unlike I think anything I've ever seen. I mean, they really feel that they are, they are a part of the, of the show. Yeah, yeah, they are. I mean, this is our 11th season and, and when we started building the studio, it was really important that the audience was comfortable and it was really important that they were not in the dark, that they were lit because they're part of the show. It's not a spotlight on me. Of course, my lighting is better. <laughs> I'm a cover girl, I have to look good. But, <laughs> but it's still bright enough that they're part of it. All she wants is to make people happy. She makes so many people happy. Yeah, what a relaxed conversation. Yeah. Too, fun to well, watch. two of our favorites yeah. right there. That was great, Robin. Uh, Sunday's going to be a good one. It's going to be a good one. Can't go wrong with Miss Ellen D.